Boy Nation, we making moves, we making grinds for the all-decade team. Shout out to the two that made it. Everybody knows that we got to stop and pop the brakes a little bit and talk about these boys. Tyron Smith, we know he's a pillar of the offensive line. One of the first picks that we start to address those particular issues and say, hey, we got Tyron. Maybe, just maybe, he can help out with this particular team as it relates to keeping Tony Romo upright. Now, Tyron Smith, he was not playing, dare I say, uh, left tackle when he first came into the league. He was actually playing the right tackle, but they saw that how big and how massive he was. And they said, look, let's just kick him to the blind side and let him hold down that particular fort. So shout out to Tyron Smith on that aspect of it. And shout out to Zach Martin. Shout out to Zach Martin. He's been a solid piece for us. I think in his career, collective career, Zach Martin only gave up anywhere between three and four sacks in his entire career. That is something important for us to realize and recognize. Shout out to you. Stay at home, ride or die, cowboy. Really appreciate you. Daniel Garcia, really thank you for tuning in. So, with that being said, Cowboy Nation, it's a good feel. It's a good vibe for us. It's a good feel. But it's also bring calls to pause a little bit. We only had two of those particular Cowboys unit to make all team decade, right? From 2010 until now. Two, and they both on the offensive side and they both on, on the offensive line. So that speaks volume of this team, of where they focus and where we had our pitfalls and our upsets on. Nobody from defense, not one, not two, not three, nobody that made the all team or all NFL all decade team. Let that sink in. And some of the people that's on that list, we passed up on when it was free 99 or we could have negotiated on. Oh, my goodness. <sighs> Buddy. So this next decade to come around the corner, y'all know I don't like defense. I love it. We need to have some, some of the defensive action out there. We do for the Dallas Cowboys. Hey, hey, hey. No, 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 no. I don't want to hear. I don't want to hear that the teams are all about. Let me pull up this list. I hope I got it right here, right in front of me. Uh, let's look at this all decade team for the 2010s. I hope you guys can see it. On the defensive side of the ball, I'm going to start with the defensive back, Chris Harris. Tyron Matthews, their honey badger. I remember we passed up on him. Eric Berry, uh, Earl Thomas, Eric Weddle. I don't know how he made it, but Eric, shout out to Eric Weddle. Patrick Peterson. Oh, a Darrell Revis, a, a, a Richard Sherman, a Chandler Jones, Khalil Mack, Von Miller, Luke Keekley, Bobby Wagner, Patrick Willis. These are all the defenses. All team decade defense from 2010. Geno Atkins of Fletcher Cox. Shout out to Mississippi State, although he played for those filthy. Aaron Donald, Sue, uh, who else out here? Calais Campbell. Those are the guys that made their all team defense. A uh, Cameron Jordan, a uh, Julius Peppers, JJ Watt. So when I get time, we're going to go over this and we'll dissect all of this. Line by line. Now, shout out to Tom Brady. He made all decade, what have you. And Aaron Rodgers, shout out to those quarterbacks there. Uh, Anthony Brown, A.B., Larry, Fitzgerald, Calvin Johnson. Okay. Calvin Johnson. <laughs> we'll talk about that, too. Uh, who else on this list? We have a Julio Jones. We have a Rod, Rob Gronkowski. Oh, a Travis Kelsey. So you mean to tell me as much as we kept Dare I say, a Jason Witten on his team, he couldn't make the all-decade team? <laughs> I'm just playing with y'all. Y'all wanted uh, Jason Witten to make that all-decade team? Hmm. All right. Uh, Jason Peters, shout out to him. Shout out to him. And then that's when we had the Tyron Smith. And then, uh, of course, we will have the Zach Martin that's on this particular list. So th that is cool. Um... Uh, Alex Mack, he's pretty cool or what have you. Frank Gore, Marshawn Lynch, LaShawn McCoy, Adrian Peterson, and even uh, Darian Sproles, who uh versatile weapon for 
uh, the New Orleans Saints to help them win the Super Bowl and also was a versatile weapon for the Eagles. I think Darren Sproles started off with the Chargers. But in 2010, I think he made that transition to go to the Saints or what have you. Y'all let me know if I'm wrong. So I don't want to see this for the next decade. No, we need to help out on defense. We want to see some defensive guys out there. Let me know if you guys feel the same way. Uh, a few names I don't agree with on that list. This is from Raw Real and Uncut. Who you don't agree with? <laughs> Bravo, Law. What's good with you, Scotty? I don't have enough. I don't have a lot of times uh, uh, to, to go live. I got to roll. Uh, D Ware should be on that list. But see, they're going from 2010 to now. Yeah. Yeah, D Ware should be on that list. Because they, they, they put, if Calvin Johnson is on that list, you put D Ware on that list. If Calvin Johnson is on that list, you put D Ware on that list. Mmm, McCoy, Shady. Shady McCoy. He was good, though. Shady McCoy was good for those first, what, three, four years of 2010, you know, all the way throughout. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shady's bad. I can't, I can't get mad at Shady, though. I can't get mad at him. Did he get him a ring last year, too? Y'all yeah, help me out. Did he get a ring? He was the main reason the Broncos won a Super Bowl. Carolina Cowboy? Yeah. Yeah. Because his influences help help elevate Von Miller. Although Von Miller was a dog. Uh, Tony Romo, come on, locks, man. If, I'm going to say this before I get up out of here. If Tony Romo, you know how you played in Madden back in the days and you turned injuries off? If you had that cheat code, you could just turn injuries off. If you go into the settings and you turn injuries off, and if you could somehow <laughs> trade out the head coach, Tony Romo would have been on that list. But they was very picky with those quarterbacks, huh? I think you got to put Russell Wilson in there. 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 I'm like repeating myself so you guys can understand. How in the world you only have Tom, Tommy Brady and Aaron Rodgers? Let me know. Cowboy Nation, that's all the time that I have. I really got to split, man. I really appreciate you all. If you disagree with the law, all you got to do is post me your thoughts and comments down below. If you agree with the law, post me your thoughts and comments down below. And if you like what I was able to lament to you all, like, share this content. Pluck that notification bell, baby. Let's go. I got to get back to work, though. But I just want to be able to say this about the All-Decade team. Only two offensive players in the offensive linemen. <laughs> Come on now. It's been my time. I really thank you all for yours. And remember, you're listening to nothing but the best. Let's go. Peace. Reach up.